In this video I'll explain how to draw a horizontal bar plot using the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's jump into the code. In the video I will show you two examples and both of these examples are based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 to 3 of the code. So if you run these lines of code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new data frame object appears, which is called data. And we can print these data to the RStudio console by running line four of the code. And then you can see at the bottom that our data frame contains two columns, a grouping column and a column containing the values corresponding to each of these groups. Now, if we want to draw these data in a bar plot using the basic installation of the R programming language, then we can apply the code that you can see in line six. And in this line of code, I'm applying the bar plot function to our values and to our grouping column. So if you run this line of code, you can see at the bottom right of RStudio that a new bar plot is created. And as you can see at this point, the bar plot has vertical bars. So if we want to align these bars horizontally, then we can apply the code that you can see in lines eight and nine. And in these lines of code, I'm using the same code as in line six. But then in addition, I'm specifying the Horace argument to be equal to true. So if you run lines eight and nine of the code, you can see at the bottom right that our bar plot is updated because now the bars are shown horizontally. So in this first example, I have explained how to draw a horizontal bar plot using the basic installation of the R programming language. However, it's also possible to use the ggplot2 package to create horizontal bar plots. And this is what I want to show you in the next example, starting in line 11 of the code. And in lines 11 and 12 of the code, I'm first installing and loading the ggplot2 package. I have installed the package already, so for that reason, I'm just going to load it with line 12 of the code. And after running this line of code, we are able to use the functions of the ggplot2 package, such as ggplot and geombar. And in lines 14 and 15 of the code, I'm creating a bar plot using the ggplot2 package with default specifications. So if you run these lines of code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new plot object is appearing, which is called ggp. And we can draw this plot to the bottom right in RStudio by running line 16 of the code. And after running this line of code, you can see at the bottom right that we have created a bar plot with vertical bars. And if we now want to change the bars to a horizontal ordering, then we can apply the code that you can see in lines 18 and 19. So in line 18, I'm specifying the name of the plot object that we have created before. And then I'm adding to this the coord flip function, as you can see in line 19. So if you run lines 18 and 19 of the code, our plot is updated because now the bars are aligned horizontally. So in this video, I have explained how to draw a horizontal bar plot using the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage, statisticsglobe.com, because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail, and I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video. Furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments, and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.